Hello then, welcome back. We'll continue where we left off. We have just uh, done the harbor raid on Mytilene. Uh, captured uh, the uh, general. And Are you ready to we'll leave? Leave and continue on the quest or the story. Let's go. There's no reason for us to stick around here. The console will be proud. We fought like wolves today. Congratulations, young man. That was quite an impressive display of command proficiency and valor. Thank you, Broke Praetor. With your guidance, I shall achieve even greater things. It was nothing. I crushed him with ease. Let it be a warning to all my foes. Valor comes easily with these brave people at my side. My companions deserve the praise. I was just performing my duty. Uh, it all comes down to luck. So, I choose one here. Uh, with his guidance, I'll achieve even greater things. But honestly, the people around me are a big help, so Valor comes easily with those uh, brave people on my side. Humility Please, is uh, virtuous indeed. However, the best of troops are useless without a good commander. It, you it do helps. Well to remember this. Unfortunately, you will get to test your abilities again soon. Um, with all due respect, we've decimated the pirates. They have nowhere to run. What do you mean? With both Lespers and Alcia Ma Asia. Mine are under our control, the pirates are toothless. Except, Asia Minor is still not under control. Cotter failed. The Pontic army has now laid siege to Chalcadon. The pirates will retreat to Asia to support their patron, Mithridates Megas. Curse of luck, that's terrible news. Is Cotter still alive? Such incompetence, what will we do? Will that uh, be a bit nicer? We do not know. Mithridates' forces vastly outnumber Cotter's legion. We must transfer our troops to Azir and quickly subjugate the region. Hopefully, we will break the siege in time to save our fellow Romans. When do we leave? Make your preparations. We leave at dawn's first light. Okay, so uh, scout Asia Minor with your Praetorians to find a suitable outpost location. Conquer Asia Minor. Salve, uh, son. Do you need anything? He had nothing new to tell me. After the ambush. We sent a few men back into the pass to collect the fallen. This blade was brought to me by a Kenturio. He said he found it on the body of young Gaius. I think you should have it. Oh, Caesar died in this campaign? Broken sword, why do you think I deserve to have this? It looks old and heirloom. It should be brought back to his family. I hope you'll have a chance to do so after the war. I know you helped him with a private matter. It'll be in good hands. Keep it. I think he would have wanted that. At your service, Legate. Yes, I am Legatus Indeed now. Indeed you are. And it is the fastest promotion I've ever witnessed. Congratulations. I suppose it's finally ours. You think it is time to celebrate? Uh, not yet. I get the feeling this will put one battle in larger war, by all means. <laughs> Very well. We shall celebrate when we're back in Rome. We're sailing in, this time to a greater battle. It is battle. unfortunate that our forces in Asia Minor have failed. But, see it as an opportunity. Now we play a more prominent role. This is your chance to truly shine. Do not waste it. You think we can succeed where Cotter failed? There's no knowing for sure. The tales people tell of Mithridates Megas make him out to be a god. But honestly, I think with Lucullus commanding the legions, not even gods can stand in our way. Metrodides sends hostages, though, including the consul. I don't think it's wise to tempt the gods. No, it neither sure do I. isn't. But I'll tell you a secret, Legate. Every land has its own gods, and you can't make them all happy. That's so, fair. If you plan to offend one, first carry favor with the <laughs> other. We're gonna piss off a god, and let's at least make sure the other gods like us. <laughs> That's basically his strategy. We've been assigned to visit Wheatrix's camp tomorrow and train their Scorpius teams. Be sure to bring them some Posca as a peace offering. Domine. <clears throat> How do you feel about it? Uh, this is about when we first burnt the fleet, so I should talk to these guys more often. We did what was necessary. Success was a natural result of our actions. Uh, it seems a great shame to destroy such large and pressure ships. I agree. You always have to do things you're not particularly fond of in order to win in the end. 
But if you're not willing to pay the price, you can simply stop playing. That's what I would have done. Hmm? What I have done. I guess I'm Legatus now, but I have no experience leading an Being army. Being Legatus places much responsibility on you. If we lose, even if it's due to bad luck, you will be responsible, not Fortuna. It is too much. How can I be responsible for thousands of people? I welcome the challenge and shall lead my warriors to victory. I guess I'll go Good. with that one. But do not forget, a commander should always be ready for defeat. We have conquered Lesbos. You are a gifted commander. I am sure this will only be the first of your many conquests. Thank you, Sinaros. This is only the start of my career. Do I sign a hint of iron in your voice, old man? We'll go with one. He's been to nice get to me. drunk on the fumes of victory. Please do not forget why you are doing this. You are from Asia Minor. You must know a lot about the land. Ah, uh, home. It's a beautiful and ancient land, but no one can truly know it. This campaign will be a test of your capabilities. You must be ready for anything. Asia Minor may look beautiful and inviting. Okay. What do you need? Glad Thermos is still alive. I am not. His foolishness cost us dearly. He did not deserve to survive. That's unfair. We were ambushed. He was wrong not to scout, scout the pass more thoroughly before sending us through. I agree with that. We suggested send our sentries. He said no. It was not only wrong, but also dumb. It led to too many unnecessary deaths. I am sure you will not repeat his mistake. This guy is painfully honest. We made it best here. We have conquered Mytilene and the entire island of Lesbos. It was to be expected. I am content, but a bit disappointed. Why? Because it was too easy, or because it's over? It did end a bit too quickly for me. Of course my it tests, was, because it was over. But mostly because there's no crowd to cheer for uh -huh. us. Without an audience, victory feels hollow. I will need to think about this. The gladiator is missing his, uh, his audience. You do not look happy with sailing towards a new battle, Cherub. I am looking forward to fighting again. And I am looking forward to having my feet firmly planted on soil again, too. I understand, so am I. Do you get seasick? We're gonna go with then one let here. Let us see to it that this journey is finished as soon as possible. See you on the field of battle. Uh, let's see, Sexus, do you have anything to share with us? Away, Legate. Now that I'm a Legatus, so will you smith something special for me and my boys? I'm just a legion blacksmith, not a magician. If you have something particular in mind, we'll talk. Right. I'm still as busy as I was before you were promoted. You'll have to leave one of your people with me to help out with your commissions. Uh, Legia Victrix in need of a skillsmith, will you move to our From camp? From what I hear, you barely have an anvil over there. Perhaps you should make sure you have the tools I'd need. Then I'll consider it. Okay, so before I can invite him over, I need to actually, you know, the pirates are getting bolder. Build they a proper another one of our galleys this morning. Geminus, tell you proper, to. you know. That's, that's right. close enough. Set up. What do you want? Okay, it's the yeah, same questions from before. Lives. Why is that person still open? Did the guy already escape? Who have I not talked to? I think I've talked to everyone. Let's uh, let's get going to Asia Minor. I'm just wondering if I'm gonna conquer Greece on my way over there. I feel like it's going a bit too quick. Sector conquered. Wait, the island of Lesbos is not on the Greek mainland. It's actually on the other side of the Aegean Sea, isn't it? I like guess one of the island islands between. Okay, I see. Let's head over here. Oh, let's check out that first. I should have probably also have garrison my legion before I left. With Carter's fleet defeated, it will take some time to move the legions into Asia. We should relocate Legio Wittrix first. Your Legionari have been sitting idle too long, Consul. They're just about put down roots. Agreed. The task of picking our path to Chalcedon will be up to you. Scout ahead with the speculatories, then use Victrix to pacify the province. 
I will follow with Legio Prima Italica to help you hold the territory you take. This is already Roman territory, the province of Asia belongs Pontus to us. Pontus has invaded Asia before. Carter was made proconsul to keep Mithridates from making another attempt. Something is different this time. Pontus has support among the local population. We have to treat Asia as hostile territory. Why do the local governments support King Pontus? Mithridates has been building bridges with them for years, while exploiting the rift between the factions of the Senate. It is excellent statecraft. They are traitors, the lot of them. Crucify them. Let their deaths serve as an example for the rest. We should learn more about the political situation before we begin our invasion, or a few rebellious upstarts will even slow us down. I feel like this is fist versus, you know, cunning subterfuge, so we'll go with the top one. That is a wise plan, but Cotter's precarious situation does not leave us much time for caution. That is also then true. we must learn on our feet, Domine. The bulk of Mithridates' army is besieging Kazikos, the only city in Asia that resisted him. With his local allies, he is too great a force for us to face. If you can discover a way to turn the other regions here against Mithridates and make them withdraw their forces from the siege, that would aid us greatly. What about the traitor? The one who lured the legion into Archelaus' ambush? He should be killed like the cockroach he is. Good that you mention it. I believe we may have found him. A Centurio called Cassius. What gave he him has away? been missing since the ambush, but a local fisherman admitted to taking him to the mainland. He speaks the local language and had family in this bus. You know where he's hiding? Not precisely, but it appears he was originally from Troas. I would say it's a safe bet you'll find him somewhere in that region. How could he have fooled he us? He probably had help. Jumping to conclusions is unproductive, but I suspect he's working for Witellius Skywilla. Forgive me, Domine, but what makes you think so? It's merely a suspicion. We shall talk about this later. We'll see what we can discover. Remember, he's no use to us dead. Visit me in my legion's camp when you have questioned him. If we're talking about interrogating spies, Calidus should be part of this. Where is he? Uh, I was expecting him to appear out of nowhere halfway through the conversation. I will go find him. I think he was being seasick. I shall check on him. Uh, we'll go with the top it one. It would not surprise me to find he's been standing right behind us this whole time. Is he a ghost? Uh, let's have a chat with all of these. Shall we, son? At your service, Legat. Dominate. Okay, they will have all the chats. Help him doff his armor. Yeah, someone is very, very seasick. Tell this thing's back down to the deck, whimpering, but it looks like being sick cleared his head somewhat. Without the armor, the feminine shape of his chest is difficult to overlook. You look like hammered shit, Kalidus, or should I call you Kalida? You're a woman. No shit, Sherlock. This is not the time to talk about that! You deceived me. You conceal yourself well, I'm impressed. On the contrary, this is the perfect time. Stand up and look me in the eye. Relax, I figured it out pretty much as soon as we met. Yeah... I did. I don't think my character did, but... We'll I do it. I had a feeling you knew about it. I just couldn't figure out why you didn't bring it up. I didn't mean to pull you into my deception. I just wanted to give you a little more time to earn my trust. You're proving yourself to be more than capable enough. At the very least, you've earned a chance to redeem yourself. To earn your trust? How dare you? This only raises my esteem for you. You must have conquered many obstacles to make it this far. I really don't care about your sex as long as you make yourself useful. Um, we'll go with one here. You're proving yourself more than capable enough. Good. I seek to be judged on my merits as a scout, a soldier, and a spy. Nothing more and nothing less. It's about time you two met. You knew about this, Consul? Oh, good. I was trying to... Decide how to break this to you. Uh, we'll go with you knew about this console. I could console. never have maintained the deception for so long without the console's help. I was shocked at first, but Kalida had more than proven her worth by the time she revealed the truth to me. I can't say this comes as a surprise. I figured you had your reasons to keep the secret, so I played along. By all the gods, you are a great woman. Ah, oh, wonderful. 
It's turning into a whole thing. When this <laughs> war is over, I will court you. <laughs> you and I will produce strong children. This gives me I Game of Thrones vibe. That as a compliment. Uh, let's give Kelly a little space, uh, but we'll have time to talk about it later. Yeah. Thank you, Legate. I'm sorry I lied to you. You have every right to feel betrayed. But I want you to keep Yulia Kalida in your Canterburnium. Militarily, you're an irreplaceable asset together. For what it's worth, I want to stay. Of course I'll keep you, it was never in question. I will keep you, but only because the council wishes me to. Of course I'll keep you, it was never in question. I'll leave you two to catch up. I have an invasion to plan. Kalida hugely approves. <laughs> Okay, we will continue our sailboat. Uh, Matic, assassin equipment. Now, this is a big question. Can I just steal this tannery, for instance? One constant track your journey in Asia, Asia Minor seems to be the roadside merchants. Do people just land the world's marketplace and everyone is a customer? Uh, I can spend 80 denarii for some wine and drink for my uh, boys. Uh, let's try it. Uh, the colors wine is light and sweet, leaves a strange taste. You don't really like it, but your Praetorians seem to be enjoying themselves. They slightly approve. Uh, soon enough, they start sharing embarrassing childhood memories of love and loss. Everyone seems to be in a mood. When all the flasks get dry, they look at you with expectant eyes. Sure, we'll buy some more for the road. Slightly approved. We lost water. Okay, that's uh, maybe not the best. Um, let's, let's get going here, see if we can find a suitable outpost location. Legion mission. You've located a good place for Legion to place their outpost. Click on it now to order Legia Victrix to move into Musia and capture the region. Just like when you took over the region of Lesbos. Okay, so... Fireman's... Uh... Dispatch. Okay, they're not yet pacified. What? Does I... <sighs> Do I need to, like, conquer this place? I guess. We can take it, though, so let's go. Okay, so I can send a legion to pick up slaves. Is that it? Let's scout this place a bit more. Temple of Apollon. Discovered a treasure observatory. I must wait. Let's go see how this goes. Um, we already have some missing soldiers. Or is that from the last battle, maybe? Um, this guy did well, let's be honest. And he has some pretty good chances right now. These guys, this guy though, has insane potential, maximum loot, basically most manpower retained and everything, so let's give him a go. How should we position the troops? Uh play defense versus to Centurionis. Uh extended line. Uh, enemy aggressiveness plus 10%, enemy defense minus 30. I think we can try that. I want to see how this pans out. Alicite hostis in informata mamidium acium. Battle is 
joined. How shall we proceed? Uh, manpower for manpower. Play defense, leech morale. I don't want to break morale. We could go for some more defense over... Eighty-two. Hmm. Honestly, we'll play defense. Quantum Let's see, fifteen fifty. Enemy Uh. Stand firm, it gives morale boost, but we lose some men. We could buy example. It increases risk by quite a bit. Let's go with stand firm here. Boost the morale. We are victorious! We can celebrate or we can give chase. Uh Honestly, giving chase would probably be good, but again, I kind of want to just get the morale up, my boys. I got some skill boosts. Uh, we lost one of them, though, which is sad. Tito's polo died. That's uh, that's not good. That's actually really bad. Let's see what we got from the legendary loot case. Some pristine medium armor and some good light armor. Superior? Ooh. Pristine Assassin's Cow. Spoils of War. Is this with money? Your Legion has captured its first region of Asia Minor, but Musi hasn't been passive yet. As soon as your Legion leaves, the enemy will tilt take over once more. In order to secure a permanent hold on the region, you'll have to carry out specific pacification missions. Open a quest log and track the pacification rule of village quest to begin. Okay. So. Okay, Misa is currently my legion camp. Water. Yeah, we're kind of running out of water, so let's go back to the outpost center. And I have a look what I need to also upgrade the, uh, Armory, so we can start crafting stuff. That would be good. Three out of six sectors pacified. Let's see, we're in Asia Minor now. Does that mean the trade has something different? No, it's the same stuff. Salve. I lost one, so I need to hire a new one. Let's see if we can find someone who actually, you know, is good. You cost... why are you cheap? What am I missing right now? Okay, Legion is on mission. Cavalry, infantry, and uh, guess this guy would work. Reckless scout, agreeable. Guess we will hire you. Close. I can't believe that idiot led us into an ambush like that. Well, we won't have to do. There we go. Let's see. Yeah. Armory. I need one iron mine and a tannery. So, uh, we can make that work. Huh. Okay. So, Boy, I need to figure out more, how I want to play this. Is that my prisoner? 
Can I make a deal with him? Akalaz. Come to see me beg and grovel. I will not give you the satisfaction. Have you asked my king how much he will give you for releasing me? No, I haven't. Well, yeah. I hope. Yeah, yeah, all is well. Salway. Ah, way, Legate. If you have a moment, there's a matter which I believe urgently requires your attention. Go ahead, I have time. Although our legion is quite new, they're already demonstrating superior discipline and devotion. Unfortunately, no matter how successful a military engagement is, sometimes the pacification of a region demands your personal attention. Uh, what do you mean pacification? It is enough to take control, but not enough to keep it. Pockets of resistance will always remain, and voices of dissent will be raised now and then. Why would anyone be foolish enough to stand against the might of Rome? That's an natural part of warfare, I suppose. Yep, we'll give Indeed. it number two. We are dealing with human beings, after all. Uh, personal attention? You mean I have to take care of every single troublemaker? Not at all. Your attention will be reserved for more important things. I would suggest that you delegate this kind of task to someone you trust, however. I would ask that you send members of your Praetorian Guard, supervised by someone from your personal contubernium. With all due respect, I'm not in charge of Legio Victrix. There is no king. Remember this country as we regain control I remember Legate. Left unextinguished, the local villagers have armed themselves and managed okay, to take a so... number of our legionari prisoner. They're now threatening to kill them. How could villagers defeat and capture train legionari? Since the men had some time off. This they were lured into a brothel and then beaten to near death. Not a war story they will tell often in the wine houses at home. I'm have sure. they made any demands? They want us to leave. Uh, can't do that. Indeed, we cannot. It I is agree. the fault of the legionary. And they deserve they... no less than death for their stupidity. Mm. But it should be you who punishes them. We can't let Greeks kill Roman citizens. <laughs> so we should execute them ourselves. Save them and execute them ourselves. How good. I will send a group of my Praetorians of to save our people. This mission... Our way, Legate. I have a bunch of... Uh, Quest now. How is morale among the legionaries? Morale has been better. Many legionaries. I believe a few victories is all the men need to rally around your command. Give me a report We're on the map. We're not full strength, but we I should also know. Okay. Be well, Turius. So it basically gives me a decent, uh, you know, follow up on how things are going. Do you have anything to say? Legate. I. Nothing. Okay. So let's check our quest log here because I have a lot of them. I thought. Three legionary for my Praetorian Guard. How do I do that? I would like the game to tell me. Uh, whack the mole. Okay, so... I have a few things we need to do here. Divide and conquer. I need to go to the Temple of Apollo to, you know, make friends. Inventory. Uh, let's have this is better than what you have. Two movement. Uh, give you this. It's actually pretty decent. Take the slightly better hat. <laughs> Oh, now I can uh, start messing about with your other, the other stuff. All right, let's learn the schematic for assassin equipment. So apparently, I need to hire uh, more troops. But where do I do that in camp? That's a big question. Can I fire the siege engine? That would actually be great. Okay, so do you have any... At your somewhere? service, Legat. Nope. This is the hospital. Are you the man, maybe? The tutor? Aside of that, I need to go and do something in my tent, I assume. Oh, hey, Legate. Would you and your Praetorian guard spar with my contubernium? It would be an honor. 
would you consider joining my Praetorian Guard? I'm honored that you ask, but okay. teaching suits me well. There's nothing quite uh, so satisfying as to take wide-eyed young men and turn... Not right now, the Curio. Okay, so that was not the correct one. Hmm. I'm wondering where I'm supposed to, you know, hire Legionari for my thing. Please excuse me. At your service. This, I assume, is just a banner. Yeah, I can, you know, customize my, uh... My people. Assignments. I need more people so I can slap them, like, one into the barracks. Where's my barracks? Okay. Need something? Is this a barracks? Yeah, this should be the barracks. Maybe I'll f I finally figured it out. Someone's probably yelling at me like I'm a dum dum. It looks like a barracks, so. But can I hire? Yeah, there we go. Hire Praetorian. I am actually a blind bat. Uh, Constitution, Scout, First Aid, different, uh, uh Reckless. He has interrupt and he has a passive skill for. Honestly, I'm just gonna hire these three for no particular reason other than I want to see how this works. Party, let's have a look here. Sign Praetorians to your party. Okay. Close. Uh, party management. Okay, so these guys actually pop straight in. Does that mean that I can have up to 12 characters in my party? Because if so, that would be pretty, uh, pretty interesting. Okay, let us move to the map. We have work to do. Pontigami is leaving. I need a uh, I need a tannery, but I also need uh, hunting grounds. Uh, produce food. Okay. Now, I want to send my legion to this current sector is not yet pacified. Okay. Uh, I had a mission on a beach somewhere, so I need to do that. Let's. Uh, Let's, let's go to Temple of... I'll send my... Can I return my Legion to... I believe they are at the campsite, so... We'll have to see. Let us enter. Okay, so it's limited how many people I can enter with, I assume. Okay, so I can only enter with six characters, but I can have a lot more, like, in my... Uh, in my thing. Okay. Small little cutscene. Okay, this is if I want to leave. Can talk to this man, Bathius. Good day to you, my friend. May I interest you in some finely crafted metalwork by local artisans? My name is uh, Octavius Artius Flaccus. What may I call you? I am you? called Voithos. 
Your name marks you as a person of great distinction. It is my honor to meet you. Yes, meet our priest. <laughs> I am both a priest of Ephesus, the god of carpenters, craftsmen, artisans, and indeed smiths. It is my view that in order to pay full and proper tribute to Ephesus Clitotechnes, one must practice at least one of his crafts. I endeavor to practice them all. If you worship Ephesus, what are you doing at the Temple Though of Apollon? I have dedicated myself to the lame one, I both love and admire Apollon. Both are gods of creation, of art and beauty. There is no temple here to Ephesus, but his works are carried out every day to the benefit of everyone. You said you sell items crafted by local artisans, not I of your own creation. I would not sell anything that I create. My hands and all that they make belong to Ephesus. I give it away freely to those in great need. But in the mercantile arts, I have found a way to sustain myself, as all men must do. Some of these items were donated to me, others I have purchased in order to resell. Okay, let's we'll see what Finally you're selling. wrought jewelry, sturdy tools, sharp weapons, items of pride and importance. Would uh, you like to take a look? You sell some materials for weapons? I would weapons? be thrilled to part with some of my materials. It is my duty and my pleasure to promote the art of smithing and other crafts. Uh, I'm in the market for well a blade. I can blade. certainly provide that. You will not be disappointed in the quality of my items. Did I just buy something? Weighted blades. Okay, so this is a... Uh, let's just buy this. Oh, teach me how to use these blades you sold you me. Wish. Okay. Schematic throwing knives. Oh. Of tools, I have plenty. Let's see. Javelin tools? Let's buy one. How many do you need? There we go. Thank you. Ah, I heard good things about that play. The guy who plays had a good day to gorgeous. you, honored Romans. I don't know. Have you need of food or medicine? I didn't like the ending. Zeus just steps down from Olympus and fixes everything. Um, basically, I can s I can steal hey, his shit. Boy, what is I your name? Alexius. I buy cured meats and medicinal herbs from the villages of Mysia and sell them here under the gaze of Apollon Phoebus. Do you sell wine? I have no wine, I'm afraid. But if you ever find yourself in our neighboring region of Troas, there is a very good vintner in a okay, village so on the coast. Okay, so Troas, where her the trader is, is close to us. I purchased from her in the past. Let me see what you're selling. Uh, I could sell some medicine for Denari. If I sell... I don't know how, like, what the price is supposed to be, so uh, now we'll just leave it as is. Man down here, you can talk to. The Man Crusher. You are the Man Crusher, aren't you? <laughs> Figure out what Pigris wants. Uh, I've been on crest here, occasional man, sure. You must be confusing me with someone else. Who are you talking to? You? Who are you supposed to be? It's been a long time. Wait, what? Man Crusher. I'm afraid not. And nothing good ever came out of that name. Cineros, the Man Crusher? Man. I was indeed known as the Man Crusher of Alicarnassus. But my past life is a distant memory now. Tell your master I don't fight for sport anymore. Cheater! I'm not here to hire you. I'm here for vengeance. I have so many questions. Man Crusher was your nickname, Sinaros? I used to be a wrestler. I was pretty good at it, too. I represented my hometown, Alicarnassus, in the Olympic Games. With honor, mostly. Honor? What do you know of honor? It is because of you my grandfather suffers now. Uh, slow down and tell me who you are. Son of Diocles, son of Diodorus, spear thrower and Pancration athlete. Champion, of course. Diodorus, you are his grandchild. Is he... Is he st still alive? Grief has turned him into a husk of the man he once was, but he is indeed still alive. Cheater! You're fighting for sport? When? Before I was sold as a servus, I was the champion of my people. 
adored and envied by many. Obviously, no one was bold enough to challenge me, especially when it came to Pankration. Until my grandfather faced you, and you had to cheat in order to preserve your fame and fortune. What is Pankration? It is a kind of wrestling, very popular around Aigaeu Mare, one of the defining competitions in our Olympiads. You were a gladiator? You look nothing like a gladiator. How did you survive? It was a long time ago, Bestia, and I wasn't a gladiator. I was an athlete, competing in the Olympiads. I have seen free citizens fight in the arena. You competed for a prize in a kind of arena. Like a gladiator. You seek vengeance, Pigris, or I am this man's dominus? Direct your inquiries at me. Uh, let's go with this. We'll try and protect him. You are him. Roman, aren't you? You would know that when a person is wrong, they are entitled to vengeance. It are doesn't exactly work like that, kid. And Roman law applies only to Romans. I don't care if your laws apply to me or not. You are familiar with the concept of reciprocity. That's what matters. Cineros, the man-crusher of Halicarnassus, stole the Olympic trophy instead of facing my grandfather Diodorus in a fair contest of Pankration. I certainly didn't see this coming. Cineros is a thief, huh? I reject that characterization of me. I've stolen only once. That hardly constitutes a habit. You should know, young man. As a result of my actions, Halicarnassus was expelled from the Union. I have paid for my crimes. I am told you were exiled and sold as a Servus. That still doesn't satisfy my grandfather's honor. The trophy belongs to my family. Give it back! That should be easy to give him his trophy and let us be on our way. Uh, perhaps you and his grandfather should fight against the Servus score. This is super petty of me, but I feel like this would be a I, good choice. Pigress, accept this challenge in my grandfather's name. He is oh, a frail old man maybe it was a bad and choice. barely lift his finger now. But you can accept me as an extension of his will. Wait. Pigris is a professional wrestler in his prime. Cinerus, however formidable, is an old man. He doesn't stand a chance against Pigris. It's not fair. You're right, Kenturio, but what is? <laughs> Perhaps this is how it's supposed to be. This is how I finally pay for my crime. I didn't expect this Let to happen. Let us make it fair, then. I shall represent Cinoros. Why would I fight you? You are not a side in this conflict. It is Cineros who committed the offense. It is Cineros who should fight. I may not know anything about your customs, but I know what you are. You are the Ororus's champion. Now accept me as Cineros's champion. What do you think, Cineros? This is my fight. My crime to atone for. But if Bestia insists, I will accept. The man has a point? You don't have to do this for me, Bestia. I don't know what to say. There's nothing to say, but you could cheer for me. Pigress the wrestler, prepare yourself. Cheer on the wrestling see what match. The gladiator knows of Pankration. He's just gonna s stop him, stab him. Oh. <laughs> You're not as scary as you look. A light torso Strength injury? Strength is no match for skill, gladiator. I'm just testing your defenses. Is he gonna get crippled or something? Where did your grin go, wrestler? You were so triumphant a moment ago. Is that all you got? Oh, it's not over yet. Okay. Uh, I think you broke my collarbone. Your footwork is sloppy. Come on, get back up. Enough. It hurts too much. You win. I love that all I four of them are looking at me instead of looking at the fight. I do not know how I will face Theodorus after this. Please leave. I have to think. <laughs> Uh, something tells you this isn't over. You don't say. Now, it said he got a light injury. 
Okay, an injury severity determines how close the character is to dying. Risk tells you likely that the injury will become more severe each day that it's left untreated. Uh, treatment information how long it will take to heal. And how much medicine we'll spend to heal. Okay, so... Treating in, choose a healer to treat your Praetorian. Healer is anyone with first aid, doctor, or physician perks. Uh, first aid can only prevent it from getting worse. Doctor can heal. Okay. Treating no one. Uh, can I start treatment? Treating bestia. There we go. First aid, doctor, and physician. So, yeah, he can do everything. Uh... So as you can see, it actually has a pretty decent, like just a light injury is a 10% drop in everything. That's, um, I guess we should keep a pretty, you know, large stack of medicine just to be on the safe side. Uh, but we are here to make friends and then we just basically, uh, Basically, you know choke slam someone. How long will you let him string you along like this? It turns out there was a snake in the basket. I only realized after it bit me. How did you survive? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe the snake wasn't venomous. Nonsense. All snakes are venomous. There was a snake in the basket and I didn't realize until it bit me. That's uh That's a yikes my guy. That's actually button in the worst way possible. Uh Theophilus. A Roman officer at my temple. I am Theophilus, High Priest of Apollon and Rula of Musia. It is foolish of you to come here, considering that we are at war. But I will not spill your blood in front of Apollon Alexikakos. Mm, okay, so I have the Legion garrison here, which allows me to, uh, you know, just go up to them and say, this is my temple. I have a Legion. You have none. Uh, it would be a shame if my men had to kill you in front of your own temple. How very gracious of you, I've come to discuss your alliance with Mithridates. Let's do this one. Your legion has unlawfully occupied Lesbos. You must leave at once, or be destroyed by King Mithridates. Uh, Traitor's rebel presumes to tell the guarders of Rome what is lawful and what is not. Asia Minus and the Roman governance. We're not occupiers, we're liberators. We're freeing Asia Minor from the Pontic invaders. My predecessor, Priagonius Mauro, was an arrogant optimus who cared not one iota for the wishes of his people. You dog-fucking Romans think you can just sit in your fancy villas and decree how people should live their lives hundreds of leagues away. Well, I say enough! With the support of Pontus, I have cast off the tyranny of Rome, unseated that sniveling sycophant Maro, and the people love me for it. They love Mithridates Megas. Uh, withdraw your support from the Mithridates, and we will instate a new local governor of Mysia. We will even consider letting you live. I don't care about Mysia, that's a mess of someone else to sort out. Withdraw your troops from the seat of Kisikos, and we will leave Mysia alone. Uh... I'll go with the first one here, Never. honestly. Musia owes everything to oh, the humbles disapprove and the arrogance of approve. Fealty to the alliance will never be broken. Uh, it seems to be nothing less to discuss, then you will be destroyed. Well, that's we what's gonna happen. About that. I failed this mission. Uh, leave the temple of Apollon. Am I about to get, uh, you know, ambushed here? Let's track this quest. Where's the exit? Ah, 
I was honestly a little bit worried that we would have a fight going on here. Party management. Oh, it's just the inventory. Why did I say I would get 10 when I only got 1? This is, uh... This is some sad fake news. Or was it that he had 10 available for sale, maybe? That could be it. Over here, please. I must hmm? speak to you. Oh. Thank you for stopping. You are the Stratigos of a Roman legion, are you not? I uh, saw you talking with Theopilus. <laughs> talking, I suppose we did, and same with Scipio, <laughs> Scipio Africanus had a disagreement with Hannibal. Uh, my title is Legatus, Stratigos is a Greek word. Uh, I guess I should just, uh, you know, introduce myself and ask who they are. My name is Zenobia. I am the widow of Preconius Maro, the rightful governor of Musia, whom Theopilus murdered. Sorry for your loss. What can I do for you? Husband failing your duties. His duties when he died to treachery. Nothing to be done. No reason I can see for us talking. Okay. I beseech you to help I'm me sorry for your loss. my revenge upon Theopilus. I have many allies still among the powerful people of Musia. Oh, you're if asking you me to help me kill Theopilus. In return, I promise to break the alliance with Pontus. You're asking me to assassinate well, him. I find that word distasteful. But yes, in essence. You have a plan? I do not. Violence is not my strength. I have no talent for it. That uh, is why I need your help. You have access to his food? Theopilus knows me and she knows that I resent him. But many of the priests here dine with him. Perhaps one of them can be tricked or threatened to help you? Uh, can you think of a way to learn to seclude the he location? He has such meetings occasionally, as any politician does. It might be possible to trick him somehow into thinking King Mithridates wants a meeting in secret. If he has a way to communicate with the forces of Pontus, we could always try our hand at a little forgery. Might I simply attack him here in you the temple? You cannot be seen to strike first. If the people turn against us, I will not be able to regain control. If you can provoke him to attack you, so you can be seen to kill him in self-defense, you might get away with it. <laughs> that should be possible. I have a talent for angering people. How well do you know the man? Does he have any sore spots we might exploit? We are not close. Perhaps someone here in this temple can give you what you need. Uh, I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Legate. My husband was a loyal servant of Rome. He wasn't perfect, but he cared deeply for his people. He did not deserve to be cut open in the night like cattle. Okay, that sounds uh, concerning, but uh, let's see if we can steal some correspondence, I guess. You know he won't. How long will you let him string you along like this? You well, you know, we could try and piss him off. I think that's the easiest way, just piss him off, have him attack me, but then we'll probably have a huge battle. Which wouldn't be too bad, all things considered, but uh, since he lives at the top here, he probably has some uh, correspondence in one of these uh, temples. Oh. Someone we can talk to. It is unusual to see a Roman soldier here in these times. Are we not at war with Rome? Uh, I was invited here to speak to Theophilus. I'm a legatus of Rome. I go where I please. I am Octavius Arceus Flaccus. Pleased to meet you. We'll go with that one. I am honored to meet you. My name is Rianus. I am a disciple of Theophilus. Where are you from? Why do you ask? Your dialect sounds familiar. I'm simply trying to get to know the people around here. Perhaps you've passed through my home region, but I should be very surprised if so. I hail from a small village in the mountains, a day's travel east of Adramition. I have a great deal of family there. It is fortunate that Apollon gifted me a keen mind, or I would be there still, herding sheep for my uncle. You like your master? I benefit greatly from his wisdom, and his piety cannot be denied. Your discretion is wise, but my Dominus has no love for yours, child. You may speak freely. In that case, no. 
I would not say that I like my master, but I respect him greatly. Have a pleasant day, disciple. So I guess this guy could potentially be the one that will uh, get to poison him. Have you sacrificed uh, anything today? Not yet. How long do I have to keep doing this? Until the gods forgive you. <laughs> Can I leave on these horses? Probably not. Where would he keep his... Oh. Help! Anyone! The temple is burning down! Oh, thank the gods you are here! You, you must help us! The temple is burning! Um... I could go logically. If I'm chasing my health and that of my people for your temple, it's only fair that we be compensated. Don't worry, though. It will be much cheaper for you to pay us than to build a whole new temple. Of course, we must move quickly. Uh, we'll do the logical Typical thing here. greedy Romans! Fine. Save our temple and we will pay you. Okay, how does this... Uh... The fire will spread quickly. Ah, Apollon does favor us. The builders have left a barrel of water for us by that statue. Okay. Let's end deployment. Uh, pick up water jug. How far can I chug the water jug? I can put out that fire at least. So you just move as far as you can. This is an interesting side mission, to be honest. Something I expected I would be doing. You still have movement points? Uh, okay, let's... Sorry, that's not what I want to do. I want to move one more step further down. Yeah, I'm gonna have to hit... One here. Let's just focus on limiting for now. See. You guys who have thrown your stuff, go back for more. If I can hit here, that would be better. Here we go, move back. And turn. It's interesting that this turned into a uh, strategy for me. Okay, let's just move you all the way down here so we can get the proper angle and then we can completely and properly, you know, get rid of the fire. If I move you down here, you get rid of that fire, you get rid of that fire. That should be all of it. He still has this light injury from earlier, so that's fine. How much money are you willing to pay me? Well, you're clapping for me. Oh, thank you. If it weren't for you, our temple would be ashes now. What was happening there? Somebody set the temple on fire. Not all of the locals are fond of Apollon. Why would anyone set the temple on they fire? They believe the temple is built on an old pathway to Hades. 
That's the reason to burn it down? According to some, the temple is blocking the way to Hades and keeping the dead from reaching their intended destination. Okay, that would be troublesome. We didn't do this for free. I'm just happy to be of help. We didn't do this for free. <sighs> I will not go back on my word. Here, your payment. Uh, okay. And spend skill points. This guy leveled up. Inventory. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Schematic for the water jug. I can now throw water at people. Throwing knife schematic. Nice to have. Do I have any other schematics here that I haven't realized? I haven't realized. Don't realize that I have. The fact that I can. The fact that I actually got that is interesting. Oh. Can I equip this on a character? Can. Let's equip it on my boy. Honestly, I am not... Uh, I'm not feeling the water jug, I'll be honest. Let's check our quest log. Let's go and see if we can just, uh, well again, the video is getting quite long, it's, uh, this game is a bit too addicting, honestly, it's, it's kind of weird, but I don't dislike it. Let's see if we can piss this guy off. In here. For the life of me, I cannot fathom why. It is because I enjoy your charming company, dear Phyllis. Get out of my sight. Can I piss him off? Here. For the life uh, of me, I'll I go wherever I why. please, let's uh. read that one. Let's do that you three times. Okay, I assume I can't get him to actually attack me then. Sad. Need to, uh... Need to assassinate him in a different way, but where is his, you know... Listen, there's a dull quality to our footsteps here. I think there is a chamber beneath our feet. I think so too, but will I fall through here? Missing item, do I need like a uh, rope or something? Oh, you know, I could just go around and see if I can enter it normally. That too could be an option. Can I enter through here? Uh, I guess I'm gonna have to put this quest a little bit on well I need time to find a potion or a pressure point so we will go and pacificate, pacificate this, uh... You we know he won't. How long will you let him string you along like this? I should probably stop and listen to them, because I'm feeling that might be the pressure point. It would be funny. But this area is just straight up huge. Let us leave this area and uh, let's see if we can get the pacification done. Because it should now show me where it is on the map. It's all the way over here. That seems to be very far inland, I'll have to be honest here. Mountaintop ruins. Uh, perfect site for a secret meeting. Let's do it like this since he's injured. I'm just curious what's here. I think this is where we would uh, use the fake correspondence to uh, mess up our guy. Soldiers, let's get out of here. 
These scavengers seem persistent. Perhaps there are stories among the locals of hidden treasure. Oh, there is some hidden treasure. We'll take it. There's also some hidden treasure here. Now this area isn't very like big, but I have a feeling that I could get the Okay, so it's like parkour treasure. Oh, I see why. A unique staff. Every time you kill a character, uh, restore health. Okay, that's, uh, that's pretty good. That was worth coming here for. Let's see who can equip this. Uh, Sunerius? Six to nine. It even comes with a healing buff, so yeah, let's uh, let's give it to our man. Then we will leave. Wait a minute, am I stuck? Well, I uh, get the beach village pacification done, and then I'll uh, I'll call it a day on the video. Do I need to wait for all of them to jump over? If I know this, I would only send one man, but that's a risk in its own. Okay, are we stuck here? Okay, we had to wait for everyone. I see. I want to leave. We also want to do the pacification so we can start actually getting resources. Let's go here as our next stop. This is actually a pretty big, like, uh... Land. Oh, armor cap. Pacify region, let's have a look at this. Do I need to enter it and fight myself? Or... Okay, so I can't actually fight this. That's, uh, that's a bit worrisome. Oh, okay, I see. Is this an automatic thing, or... Yeah, this might be bad. Yeah, I I definitely need it more because uh This might uh this might quickly become troublesome. I reached the captive legionary to release him. At least four legionary must survive. Okay, so basically, I need to rescue these people. Okay, that's why they're white. Yeah, I should have brought more people. I did not think this through. I can start down here and then rush down the middle, but even that seems risky. I should go. Left side, maybe, first. I brought two archers and one javelin boy. Yeah, this is gonna be bad. He has one heck of a shield as well. Fire arrow, piercing skill, uh, let's fire arrow him. 
have you stand here so you can kind of block anyone that steps there and there. Backstab. Lacerate. Okay, so you're not actually by side, so let's do this. Fire arrow, barbed arrow, applies bleeding. Fire a barbed arrow into him. It might kill him slowly. Defensive formation, slow and steady. I should have read through this mission properly because this is uh, this is bad. He ran through all of my boys like no problem. And a secondary attack. Okay. Yeah. This might be a game over scenario. Stand your ground. Let them come to us. He's gonna bleed out, so I don't actually need to attack him. But the problem is because he is uh, close. Uh... Okay, they attacked him. Yeah, that's kind of what I was afraid of. I am so screwed. He took five damage from that, okay. Only three damage, love it. Please kill him, thank you. It's not great yet, but if I can release these two and uh, well, basically use four of these people as bullet sponges we might still be able to pull something off here there we are we stay here they must fight on our they kill one I um, might actually kill two bad luck Get over there advance we need to release those two super quick here formation slow and steady Tell me you can stop bleeding Medicaid. honestly um, no I cannot but I should be able to backstab this why is this not a backstab do I need to stand here let's uh, knock down this guy there we go still unarmed Okay, I only did three damage. Uh, we're gonna have to, yeah. Uh, can I retreat? Is there a way to retreat? Doesn't look like it. Uh, Kay says that I'm going to be in a bad spot in a second here. I can get behind them. I don't think it's healthy to bleed this much. My love for Rome is fine. I'm fine. Okay, he ran in the, like, like an idiot. I need you to release him. Okay, he has been released, I assume. It's green now. Let's run up there. I can't control these guys, but. Uh, I am hoping that they will do something.
basically they're going to be cannon fodder to some degree. Stand your ground. Let them come to us. So these three became cannon fodder. That's the best way I can describe it because I'm not going to be able to save them. Well protected here. Be ready. Blood doesn't stop flowing on its own, you know. That is a lot of blood. Uh, is that bad? Can you first aid yourself? There'll be time to bleed later. Yeah, remove bleeding. Uh, then run down here. These guys, I can't actually control them, and these guys are all, you know, advanced classes. You might actually be able to pull something off. They must fight on our terms. Only glancing blows. Ah, the disarm is gonna mess him up. That is a lot of blood. Let's is put a weapon on again and blood doesn't stop flowing on its own, you know. I guess I should actually just help here, but that six defense shield boy is a problem. Let's try and kill these two and make life a little bit easier for all of us. Ah, I forgot something very important. Come. I'm fine. It only looks like I'm bleeding. Let's move down here. Yeah, this is gonna be bad. Like, really bad. Maybe not, because it seems. Oh. He's, uh, formation. Slow and steady. I could try and drag them up. Oh, okay. I'm gonna try and run Stay past here. them. They must fight on our time. Okay, I got both of them unlocked. This might actually still be salvageable. By oh, he's rest. He's healing my boy. Nice. Oh, enemy reinforcements. That's bad. Save your arrows until you see the whites in their eyes. That glancing hit was enough to kill him. Three hours is bleeding out, four turns left. Why did he take damage? Okay, this is bad. Uh, let's go and deal with them. Until they come to us. I just need four of them to survive, so it's still doable, but it doesn't feel too good, Chief. What the? Stand your ground. Let them come to us. Okay, let's kill him. I shouldn't have killed him, because now I'll take another round of burning damage. Let's take cover. Good job. Let them bring the fight to us. 
Please heal me, Medicus. Otherwise, I'm gonna be in trouble. We are well protected here. Be ready. Where is my next boy? He's over here. They're both over here and they have no enemies near them, so... Could be interesting. Cover your angles! They will not take us by surprise! I should have healed myself. Uh. I need help. Will this guy rest him? Okay, the AI is actually resting their own boys. That's Oh, he straight up finished him up. Right for the enemy. They gonna go down again? Oh, he rests a lot more than I thought he did. Wait here until they come to us. I also do like that the fact that to release is just walk up to them. Let them come to us. That's really bad. Um, I think I want to go back around this way because it's one here and there's one here that I need to release. Because the problem right now is that they're being dumb. I need them to rush, and they're not doing that. That arch is actually going to just pick us off one by one. Panicked and ran out in the open. I need you all to do the smart thing, and you're refusing to do that. Slow and steady. Okay, get up here, and then maybe I can make a run for it on this one. Hide behind the. Uh... Let them bring the fight to us. You say that, but they have at the high ground. We'll face them together. He's act they're actually coming for me. That's just. Uh... Uh, this is bad. This is a real bad. No other way up there. I could go over here and hide. Let's try this move. Then look that way. Cover your angles. They will not Come on. Take us by surprise. There you go. You're starting to. You're starting to get it. Oh, 
Okay, that's uh That's a dirty trick. Save your arrows until you see the whites in their eyes. Just heal yourself, bro. One more left. Stay in cover. On. We, we wait do this. for the enemy. Wait here until they come to us. Just that one bowman left. I'm sorry that I've been so quiet. I uh, I'm tired. This uh, this was a bit more. Intensive than I uh, expected. Hopefully, I can loot all these bodies. Okay, now all we need to do is uh, murder this man. Let them bring the fight to us. Hungering down. So we lost, uh, you know, three of the cheap ones. Uh, very, very sad. Hopefully, I can find enough loot here to, you know, make it uh, make it worth. Flax leveled up, Cinderos best leveled up. So they got le they got experience even though they weren't part of the fight. That's uh, interesting. Can I loot my own boys? Nah. Weak robes. Loose coins. Anthian helmets. I wouldn't expect, you know, rebels to have any good shit anyway, so, uh. Oh, medallion of Mars. Base damage maximum. A minimum increase would have been better. Add accuracy and hoplite equipment. Ooh, hoplite equipment. I actually, uh, actually like that one. The boss. An auto loot would be fine because this gets tiresome after doing it like 20 times. But at least I've learned my lesson here that I need to actually have five. Uh, I actually need to have five proper disposable Praetorians uh, that I can use for these missions because that uh, that hurt a lot, and I should just rush to release them, and they'll do most of the job for me. Sector conquered. So now we can start taking control of the farms and things like that, I assume. Send your legion to capture a lumber mill. Annery. Okay. So skill-wise, uh, I have one unspent point. Could go for a headbutt. I could go for movement reduction. 
Uh, let's see. Stand fast. I stun two enemies. That's interesting. Honestly, picking up headbutt here is uh, something I feel like is is, is okay. Uh, could be worse. Let's give him the passive skill here, more resistances. Healing, let's put that one up there. Cure not. There we go. Cure restores 25% health per status effect removed. If that stacks with this, that's gonna be great. Uh, do I want this to use him as basically a uh, leader? Sorry, um, as a, you know, anti leader, murderer. But I also need. Let's just go with Bloodless for now. But I also need, you know, armor break. Um, double the damage dealt, so it's 6 damage. Quick shot. Could be fun, but uh, let's upgrade. Yeah, I don't care for the interrupt going. Let's upgrade this. You could additionally apply knockdown. I would actually be pretty good if we can get knocked down to a gracing shot, uh, flashing damage. Okay. But uh, with that said, we're going to. Uh, going to leave it here and we're going to continue next time because I've been uh, at this for far longer than I should have been. So uh, thank you for watching and I hope that you've enjoyed and uh, I hope to see you next time. Bye bye!